Um, is it too? Is it wrong? Is it wrong? <laughs> <laughs> it looks so weird. Yes. It's wrong. Hello guys! Welcome again sa another unboxing uh, dito sa ating channel na Perfect Unboxing. If you are not subscribed yet, please do hit that subscribe button down and hit that like button as well. No? So follow us with a lot of unboxing episodes to come. And today, we're going to unbox not only one figure and we're going to do the review as well, but four figures. So we're going to have some special guests to play with us with these toys. No? Let me welcome to you the ENG Toys channel. They can be found on ENG Toys in YouTube. So let me introduce you, Emily. Come on. There you go, Naomi. And Gabe. Yeah, so ENG Toys, they are ENG Toys. Follow them and subscribe to them so that you can see their unboxing. And sometimes they do play games as well. All right, so guys, are you excited to unbox this four box of figures in front of us? Yes. Yes, yes. and so, as, you, as I have mentioned before on our teaser, no, uh, whoever co uh, commented or figured out what we will unbox today will get a free comic book. So whoever is the first, congratulations to you and you're gonna get this free comic book. We're gonna tackle about the, the, the figure itself, no, its scale, its articulation and everything. So please do watch out. And so what are we waiting for? Let's go dig it. Let's go. <laughs> Alright, so here we are. Uh, papakita ko sa inyo yung packaging or yung box na uh, The Loyal Subjects Best Action Series. Actually, marami silang ano eh, no, series. Meron din silang Power Rama, nandun yung mga Marvel. At syempre, nandun din yung, uh, meron din silang isa pang series kung saan makikita mo yung mga fantasy na characters and horror characters and even mga rockstar characters. And also, one note, no, anime characters like Naruto, uh, full Metal Alchemist, uh, nandyan po sila, no? So, ang maganda sa kanya is yung, yung pwede mo silang pagsamasamahin, no? So, start to start off, makitignan natin yung packaging, no, ni Leonardo. Makikita natin, yan, may best action dito, yan yung series. It has a name here, Leonardo nga, no? From Nickelodeon, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, and you can actually see the figure from the inside including the accessories at dito sa gilid niya may parang art no napaka nostalgic nito kasi ito yung ano eh parang a uh, 90s version or 80s to 90s version and then also at the same time parang siya na rin yung game version no what i love about this figure is a new look and a new take on the action figure no kasi more normally makikita natin yung mga action figures is nasa range ng uh, scaling ng 6 inch no 4 inch but this Bex action series is a 1 is to 15 scale tama yes 1 is to 15 scale so around nasa mga uh, 5 inches 4.5 to 5 inches no so tingnan natin yung gilid ng packaging Sa gilid ng packaging, may kita natin yung four turtles, no? Nantawa lang ako kasi yung R ni Rafael dito is baliktad. Ayan. <laughs> Tignan nyo yan. Ayan. Look closely. Baliktad, no? R. Ayan. <laughs> Parang naka-mirror siya, no? So, yan sila, no? Pero yung other naman is okay naman sila, no? Si Michelangelo, Leonardo, Donatello, and Rafael. And also, may best action dito na logo, no? I just wish na sana iniba-iba nila yung art nila dito, no? Kasi kung makikita natin sa iba pang mga packaging is they just change the colors no according to the bandana na suot nila. Yan. So, sana ginawa na lang nila is either yung eto nilagay nila dito no sa gilid or etong posable uh, figure na uh, photo no nilagay nila dito para 
pag tinabi-tabi mo silang ganyan, ay maganda silang tingnan. No? Unlike this one, pare-pareha sila, iba-iba lang ng color. But then, yep, it's still a good packaging. No? So, they have a 31 points of articulation. Wow! For the price na mura, 31 points of articulation. Grabe, no? Imagine that. And makikita natin yung mga accessories here. Yan. Yan. And tignan nyo na lang yung scope. Yan. Let's see later no, kung ano yung makikita natin dyan. And syempre, may warning, choking hazard dahil sa maliliit na items no, or accessories. Okay, so let's go ahead and unbox them all. Tignan natin sila out of the box. Boom! Nakikita niyo yung art, no? There is a Leonardo sign. You can put this as a background and turn those. And from here, you can see the drawing. No, ayan, may art pa siya. So, yan yung artwork. Bye bye. Wow, meron silang best action na. Ano to? Okay, so let's see the figure itself, no? Look at that, ganda. Yes. And napaka-heavy niya, no? Mabigat siya. Hindi siya ganun ka... Alam mo kasi ibang figure, hollow, eh, no? But this one, I don't think it's hollow. Kasi medyo mabigat siya, eh. Kita niyo yung pagka-mold. Ganda ng mold ng, ano niya, ng kanyang head. And yung bandana niya. No? Ayan, nakasmile siya. And syempre, ito yung kanyang ayan, fighting uh, or angry na scalp na head. Ayan. I love the way that they made the eyes na may ano pa talaga. Detail talaga yung eyes niya. Yung kanyang paint, um, I just wish na ano, no, yung, yung kanyang paint, dark green siya dyan. But here, parang neon green or light green siya. But then again, it's a nice figure kasi talagang napaka-nostalgic niya. Parang straight out of 80s. Ayan. So, kikita niya dyan yung letter L. Yung mold niya. Ayan. Yung paint niya, ganda ng pagka-paint niya. No? Although, wala siyang contouring na black. Pero, pulido yung pagkaka-paint niya. Walang lagpas na paint. Walang anong... It's a beautiful figure. 31 points of articulation pero syempre hindi ko na ipapakita lahat sa inyo papakita ko lang kung ano yung mga uh, highlights ng articulation niya ayan ang kanyang articulation is ayan left or right sorry to the left ayan up and that's the highest na kaya niyang itingala and ayan hindi na kayang tumungo ganun lang siya ayan And I like the fact na nilagyan nila ng ganito, no? Yung ano ni Leonardo. And hindi siya ganun katigas, no? So, pwede mo rin i-adjust ng ganyan. Alright? Okay. So, yung kanyang wingspan, ayan. Butterfly joint doon sa kanyang el shoulders. And then double joint sa kanyang elbows, no? Ayan. Kaya niyang gawin yung ganyan, no? Ganda! Pwede. And sa kanyang wrist. Ayan. Katitignan natin. Ayan. Pwede, no? Wala lang siya sa fingers. So, ganyan lang siya. Okay. So, waist. Kaya niyang mag side. And ab crunch niya. Oh, wala masyado, no? Walang ab crunch, no? Then, parang nat ano siya, no? Hindi siya nakadikit masyado. Alright. And then, syempre, yung kanyang belt. Ayan. With the letter L. 
Leonardo still yung kanyang foot sa tie yan may ikot siya may ikot ayan tingnan natin kung gaano ka uh, ayan hanggang diyan lang siya no para sa kick ayan kaya lang medyo maharang lang to kaya hindi mo masyado mo forward no so hanggang ganyan lang siya okay split ayan yung split okay then ay ikot yung sa tie sa knee niya, yan double joints para dun sa pads and then sa kanyang ankle yan, wala nang turning dito sa leg hindi na mala iikot there's no toe articulation ha? naka ball joint yung ano yung dun sa ankle kaya maganda, no? pwedeng kahit anong ano ang gulo, yan, ganda yan, so makikita natin Yan, naka close fist no pag sumusuntok and syempre yung kanyang set of hands kung saan pwede niyang hawakan yung kanyang dalawang side uh, dalawang katana swords i mean right, so tingnan natin yung ano wow um maganda yung ano no yung details ng kanyang katana swords kaya lang yung malleability niya no medyo malambot so madaling mag-deform, no? But then again, it's good na rin kasi uh, the kids can play it because it's so soft and hindi siya nakakasakit, no? Hindi siya, kahit itusok mo lang ganyan, hindi ganun kasakit, no? But then, syempre, huwag natin ipapalaro sa kids without our guidance. Yan, subukan natin yung isang ano. Madali lang tanggalin, ha? Hmm, yun. Let's see. si Leonardo okay now let's go to Donatello let's unbox Donatello no? Mm, purple purple Donatello ah, iba naman ang kulay ng kanyang Sticker ba to? I think it's a sticker, no? Best option sticker. Okay. Ayun. So, iba pala yung ano niya, yung kanyang holster kasi kay Leonardo ay dalawa siya, no? Yung kay Donatello this time, ito yung kay Leonardo, itong kay Donatello, isa lang because he has only one rod or staff you can put there, no? Yeah, ganyan siya, no? And then, when you put it here, it's the same format. So, dalawang butas lang siya. But then, yun. Mas maganda yung kay Leonardo kasi medyo tight siya and nag-hold siya and kitang-kita siya kapag nasa front view, no? Kahit hindi niya hawak yung kanyang rod. Alright, so let's go with Raphael. Yan, isa sa mga turtles na napaka-serious. Yan. Right? Let's open it. So, one thing I noticed is medyo mahirap siyang buksan. So, if you're a box collector, please be sure that you put it carefully, not like me. Yan. No? Nasira na yung, ano, kasi medyo mahirap siyang buksan. No? You no? Bye. And Raphael, no? With the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Ayan. Pareha sila ni, ano, ni, ay, medyo nag-loose yung, ano, yung ibang accessories. Pagkabukas natin. Pareha sila ng logo color ni Donatello.
Kung mapapansin nyo, iba na naman yung design ng kanyang holster. These are for the two size. Okay. And then you can put it there. Sa kanyang back. Yun. No? Medyo loose lang siya, no? pero it will do. Ganda naman siya. Tignan. Yep. And then, beside the size, meron siyang another set of accessories, which is the star. And itong parang, dapat ito may tali ito, eh, di ba? Mas maganda kung may tali ito, no? Or talagang ganyan lang siya. Alright, next up is uh, Michelangelo, the party dude. Yan, ang pinaka-favorite kong character. So, let's go rip it apart and check what's inside, no? Okay, so nalaglag itong best action sticker kanina. Ayan. Michael Angelo. Okay. okay, so Michael Angelo, right? So they have the same mold and sculpt with the uh, other turtles. Siyempre different lang is yung kanyang uh, smiling face dito, no? Or serious, a little bit serious face. And the color of the bandana and the, uh, uh, ito, yung kanyang mga... Ayan, uh, ano ba tawag dyan? Mga straps. And also, the letter M, Michelangelo. But the same with the holster sa other turtles. Uh, are the accessories. Siyempre, may two nunchucks na kasama. Si Michelangelo. Ayan, ang kanyang favorite na gamitin na weapon. Alright? So, it's kind of soft, pero hindi naman siya nagbe-break, no? So, it's okay. And siyempre, yung kanyang holster will be different as well because you need to insert yung kanyang dalawang nunchucks. Which is there. Alright, there you go. So let's put it there. Hmm. And also, he has an extra accessory which is the grappling hook. No? Uh, I believe the grappling hook on the old versions of the turtles are like uh, strings. No? But this time it's a uh, hard plastic. No? So, I think this is for an action pose na kunyari nag grappling hook siya sa isang building or whatever. One set of hands with uh, punching for punching enemies and another set of hands for uh, the accessories. No? Ayan. Hang 10, dude! Surf's up, dude! Stoke to the max! Cowabunga, dude! So, uh, you saw the four turtles now in action. Okay, let's do the scaling of that one. Let's see, it's around 4.8. No? Around 4.8 inches. And if we check with the other figures, let's see. Oh, kidding aside, let's move that away. Alright, so this is side-by-side -side comparison between the NECA TMNT and the Best Action Series. As you can see, medyo mas nostalgic yung ano, ano, Best Action Series. But then again, it's just a little bit too green, uh, parang neon green. No? Uh, and you can see that in TMNT NECA, uh, they have contours. No? But compared to Best Action, it's just plain uh, color paint. Ayan. So, yan yung difference nila. And according to their height, mas malaki lang ng konti yung 
uh, TMNT NECA. Uh, besides the TMNT uh, best action series is the G.I. Joe classified and the Star Wars uh, Boba Fett from the Black series. No? Yan. So makikita nyo yung height niya, medyo mas malaki talaga siya. No? Kasi ito is nasa range ng 6 inches while this is like 4.8. And same goes with the uh, Boba Fett. Yan. This one, this is like Donatello. He's the like tech guy. And this one and is Leonardo, I like the leader of the pack. Michelangelo is the, the cool dude party goer. Okay. I want to change her head. I want to change her head. It's you. The leader is eating the pizza. Oh, Let me get this sword. I'm gonna get the pizza. I'm Show us the pizza. Eating. He's eating. <laughs> eating. Mm. 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 Okay, holding the and. Ew, what is it? Um, is it Is it wrong? Is it wrong? <laughs> <laughs> it looks so weird. Yes. It's wrong. That's a different uh, hand. Supposed... That's the right hand. It's kind of it should oh. be the left hand. And now I come over to her place. The pizza. Oh, oh yeah. Look at that pose. Look at that pose. He's holding this wooden stick and also the pizza which he's eating was I think. <laughs> what do you love most about the toy, Kuya? Um, I think Game. it's the accessories and its color. The color is nice. It's yeah, kid friendly. I like the color too. And how you can change the. It's easy, no? Yeah. Yeah, it's easy to change. How about Emily? Yay! I love the character and I love the picture and the. Imagine it's walking and then he just. Accessories. You like the yeah. accessories. Nobody likes him. I like him. Oh, he's <laughs> Alright guys, thank you once again for being with us and uh, watching this episode of our unboxing of the Loyal Subjects Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Best Action Series. It is indeed an awesome figure and if you don't have it, you can get it at Comic Cave UAE. They are located in Dubai Outlet Mall or you can also visit their website in the description link. Uh, once again, thank you so much and hope to be with you soon again on our next unboxing. These are the ENG boys, ENG toys, sorry. Oh, yeah, uh, yeah, these yeah. adorable kids and perfect unboxing. So see you guys. Bye. Bye.